So Lewis is showing us a really cool feature that he created, and I think it would be very helpful for your business. So Lewis, do you want to show us what you did? Of course. Uh, well, what we did was a feature that uh, whenever a lead or a contact sends an email to your organization, and within that email, you have one or many attachments, those attachments are retrieved and are stored um, whether in the attachment section of the record or in a work drive folder related to that record. So for example, let me send an email. I just changed my email address for this record. Mm -hmm. so let me send an email from my account. So you're sending an email from the email that we see on the page, basically Tom's email and it's exactly. being sent to someone that is in the CRM, a user. Exactly. Okay. Maybe the feature is something like, for example, when um, a client is looking for their own client to send some type of document, mm -hmm. they tell you, okay, just reply to me with your documents. Mm -hmm. They want the documents to be uploaded automatically. So let's say I received that first email and I'm replying to them with my ID or my uh, driving license, things like that. So, let me send it. so yeah. ju 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 just a second, uh, Luis, uh, sure. just for the use case. So let's say that you can create this functionality. Uh, for example, when I need my client to send me his driving license, I will ask my client to have in the subject driving license and only then this script will take place. So it will not upload all the attachments. It will upload only the driving license attachments. Is that correct? That is correct. That is also possible. We can um, set some sort of criteria. So as you mentioned, not to have all the attachments uploaded. Very good, very good. Okay, very cool. Can, can you show us a small demo? Of course. So in this case, give me one sec. Now I will refresh the record. Okay, so now you refresh the page and we see that you have attachment number three. So the email was received and that was... For this cute baby. Baby, this is Spider-Man baby, beautiful. Okay, <laughs> and can you show us also the work drive? For sure, there is a URL set here. So wait, wait, wait. So go, go back one second. Of course. So what you did here is basically when the lead was created, you created automatically a work drive folder that is storing uh, all those documents. Correct. And it's um, exclusive for Tom. Got it. So Tom will have his own folder under the okay. clients in under the documents in work drive. Correct, under documents, we create Tom and there are all the tests that we have done. Very cool, very cool. Okay, so uh, Carol, as you said, it's a very cool functionality. I think uh, it, it deserves to be on the YouTube. So for sure we'll upload it. Thank you guys, thank you very much. Mm.